Welcome back, my fellow collectors. I'm Calvin, aka Statue Fanatic, here with another review. And today we're going to take a look at another small scale statue from Kotobukiya. This is of My Hero Academia, at least from the anime My Hero Academia. This is Izuku Midoriya, and this is a much, much, much beloved anime. Uh, around the world. Millions of people love this anime and this character, one of the main characters that evolves throughout the uh, evolution of the anime, which I've also watched now and think it's a really great anime. It's a great jumping on point for people who may not be into anime. It, it just really has a lot of the elements that most people love about anime. This is from Kota Bakia, part of a new line. I don't know if it's a new line, but they call this they, their Artifacts J line. And the reason of this line, according to this, is to make their anime characters, or make anime characters more accessible worldwide. And so we are going to, this is the box, for example, here. You can see what the box looks like there. There's a lot of uh, very bright colors on the box, reminiscent of anime, and then pictures of the character here on the box. So without further ado, let's just get this out of the box. So here you have Izuku Midoriya out of the box. Do a once around here so you can see what he looks like here. And then one other thing as far as um, this character is concerned, this is really interesting the way they do this, but I can actually put a different face and facial expression on him. But it doesn't come in the box that you saw. It comes, it was shipped. It's weird. It was shipped with the box and everything, but this wasn't in that box. It was in just by itself in the plastic packaging inside of the shipping box, but not inside of the art box itself. And it came with a little sheet instructions on how to take his hair off and how to put this on. But as you look at this, when we turn it around, um, I've had a chance to look at it for a little bit here and very, very impressed. The colors look great on this figure. Um, I really like it a lot. He looks pretty much just like he does in the anime. I think they did a really good job with this. Uh, some cell shading on here to give this character depth looks really amazing. Starting here with the base, as you look at the base, the base where he's standing on this rock formation, that shaded really well, the sculpting on that's nice. And then up to his shoes, the bright red colors, the white, love the paint application on it. And then if you look at the shoe strings, for example, did a really good job of, you know, making the paint really clean, look nice, all the way up to his legs. The same thing with the outfit that he's wearing here, the um, bluish, greenish, turquoise outfit that he has on. The paint lines on that are clean and look really nice as well. Hands all look really good. This, I think, is a really good representation of the character from the anime. Um, if you're a fan of My Hero Academia, anyone would that's a fan would probably love to have this sitting on their desk in their collection or something like that. Look at his hair, sculpted really nicely. In fact, the entire sculpt on this is really cool. I like it a lot. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and take off his hair, I think is how I remember doing it, and put on a second face um, here. So let's see if we can get that off. Well, before I do that, I just wanna make, to point out that his head actually comes off of the peg. That's the only part that, you know, it comes apart is you can actually take his entire portrait off. And once you take his portrait off, I think you can take the front part of his hair off. And once you take the front part of his hair off, um, I don't think the face comes off. Yeah, the face comes off like so. Then you can take the second face and put it on. Looks more serious and perplexed and focused and uh, snap the hair back in place. So we can get that. And then just put him right back on the stand there. And there you have it, there's a second face. Again, two thumbs up for this piece. I'm a fan of the anime. I think the anime is a really, really, really cool show. Um, lots of fun watching the show. And I have two more uh, pieces that I have from My Hero Academia that I want to, that are Kotobukiya pieces that I want to share. Well, that pretty much concludes my review of Izuku Midoriya from My Hero Academia, Kotobukiya Artifacts J statue. Really cool pickup. Paint job's great. The sculpt on it is great. The colors look great. His pose look great. 
loving it all. And remember to always collect what you like and not the hype. Until next time, my friends. Peace.